Hello to friends and welcome to my channel. In this video, it's my uh, pleasure to share with you another beautiful uh, custom knife made by Slovak knife maker Pavel Jarabica from Dark Edge Knives or Deck. So this is the D4 Alpha and this is his take uh, on a universal um, combat outdoor Huntsman uh, knife. He tried to uh, incompose uh, the the universal, uh, universally applicable design features to one knife, which is really hard to to do. And this is his take. So it goes uh, with a ambidextrous uh, sheath, as you can see here, uh, with his signature belt attachment. We can position it differently, like you want. Also uh, for left and right carry horizontally, and also uh, standard vertically carry. The blade, and also the, the whole knife, is a full tank knife, of course is made out of N690CO, so baller, uh, a nice corrosion resistant tough steel, well proven. Uh, one of the prominent features uh, is the Aegis Guard, uh, which, which, is, uh, which makes this one really uh, locking in your hand really nicely right there. Just keep in mind I have an XL size hand, so if you are smaller size hand, you will have no problems. If you have a larger than XL, then probably you will have a little bit of problem here, but um, shouldn't be a problem. Okay, so we have a really nice hollow grind blade with a convex uh, false edge on the top which is not sharp but can be sharpened really easily it is prepared to be sharpened if you want this one to be a fighting knife of course then you will be benefiting from a, a double-edged uh, almost you can see the shape is almost a dagger shape but still has the signature uh, dark edge knives um, should I say uh, symmetry right here the finish on this one is a distressed used finish just to be uh, just to not uh, uh, worry so you are not worrying uh, the damage or scratch up the knife because it is is made uh, for you uh, right now in this almost something like a battle worn finish almost faded uh, acid splatters right there so if you are uh, somebody who doesn't want to uh, to see scratches and dings on your blade so this finish is uh, really nice to have before because uh, your eye uh, focuses on different um, points or places on the blade and it will not pick up any kind of scratches and so on it has it has also a finger choil uh, which you can use for uh, choking up but uh, uh, I don't know if this is an intended maybe just is a, a larger sharpening choil because your finger my finger is really large and it is not that comfortable to to use it of course you can you can choke up like this for a detailed work but anyway it is really hard to to make a uh, universal knife for all all the tasks you can uh, came up uh, outdoors being a huntsman so uh, maybe maybe cleaning up some game or just be a, be a camp knife uh, be a utilitarian knife in in the in the military so it is really hard to to envision a let's say blade shape or 
or blade design or uh, which um, grind to use convex hollow and so on so this one is a really nice take on a really hard task if somebody will give you a task make me a universal knife only one knife that i will use for everything uh, not every maker uh, can produce a knife that uh, will be uh, will be ready to tackle the task. Maybe they will try. Everybody likes to try, but uh, in my opinion, it is impossible. So therefore, I appreciate that uh, that Powell did try to uh, to envision something like a true universal knife to be also uh, battle ready. Maybe have a striking surface here. For a non-lethal uh, compliance uh, tool, yeah. Beautifully made. Okay, let's continue the the finish on the on the handles. So these are uh, G10 handles with a uh, red liner right there. Uh, this finish he's calling the sepia finish. And it is something like cratering or um, a little bit reminiscent to a Strider uh, gunner grip. Uh, what it does, it will, will grip your hand even if you don't have any kind of gloves. For which uh, if you are using it in outdoors, you probably don't have gloves. But uh, yeah, it really locks your hand and uh, has a really nice texture. I really love this texture. Even I, I'm a fan of, of Strider's uh, gunner grip uh, finish on the handles, on the G10 handles. Uh, these are not sharp in any way, so they will lock really nicely your hand. I hope you can see it also in a reverse grip. So yes. Beautiful knife, uh, custom knife made by unique uh, knife made by Paul Jarabica. Let me give you uh, quick specifications, like I always try to do. So we have a blade length of 12 centimeters or 4.7 uh, inches. The thickness is 3.7 millimeters, 0 0.14 inches. The overall length is 24 centimeters or 9.4 inches. The weight uh, of the knife is uh, 196 grams or 6.9 ounces. The sheath is 87.9 or 3.1 ounces. And the complete package weighs uh, 283 grams or 10 ounces. So nice uh, compact weight for an all around uh, utility knife. Okay, at, at this point I will probably uh, I probably should make a size comparison with other knives, but uh, please keep in mind this is a uh, probably one of custom made knife. I don't know if uh, Pavel made more from this. Uh, usually, uh, usually you can uh, uh, send him an email. I will uh, show his card right now. I hope he doesn't mind. Here's also his phone. Um, you can contact him and inquire if he uh, is available uh, keep in mind this is uh, his hobby um, and he also has his day job and family to have uh, to take care of so uh, maybe uh, write him an email and uh, ask him about uh, also check out his uh, blog and also i will try to link down his youtube so we can go and check out his new works. Uh, he's posting uh, regularly when he has something new uh, that he's made. So go check him out. And if you have any questions, you can ask me or you can directly ask him. I'm more than happy to reply as soon as I can. And I wish you a wonderful day. If you are a subscriber, thank you very much for watching. If you are not, then please consider subscribing. I try to release at least three videos per week. Mostly knife and gear oriented, but also sometimes uh, hobby stuff like tools and Warhammer and so on. Okay, so wish you a wonderful day and see you soon.